I'm Jamie Costello with your WMAR 2 News Update. There have been now more than 100,000 cases of COVID-19 in Maryland. Millions more, of course, across the country. Some of the people caring for those patients end up catching the virus. WMAR 2 News, Aaron McPherson shows us a new way for healthcare workers to protect themselves while caring for COVID-19 patients. Dr. Steve Trapello has been working here in Baltimore for several years, and in just the last few years, he started to create medical devices. And that's why when this coronavirus pandemic hit, he knew he had to do something. Put our gloves on, get our hands ready. A Baltimore doctor simulates helping a patient. CPR is being performed. While making sure his team is safe using the Care Cove prototype. It's very simple. The cove is placed over the patient to isolate the viral particles to keep them away from the provider and at the same time allowing optimal care for the patient. Dr. Steve Trapello is an emergency and critical care physician on the front lines of this coronavirus pandemic. Now that testing is better, we're focused on these high risk events that happen immediately. So people, you know, can't breathe all of a sudden, lose their pulse. I don't have time to know what your COVID status is. So you need something that's immediately available. This prototype is disposable and lightweight. It easily pops open to be deployed. So you don't want a device that's going to take 10 minutes to set up on a patient when they don't have a pulse. This has to be done uh, fast. The Care Cove idea was sparked when Dr. Trapello had to intubate a patient back in March. When COVID hit in March and people were coming to me saying, hey, use this plastic garbage bag, clear plastic garbage bag to intubate your patients. I just thought it was crazy. I've refused to do that. There was so much unknown at the time and not enough PPE. So that's when he went to the drawing board with the team he's worked with before creating medical devices. We put pen to paper. We designed the Care Cove from scratch and here we are iterating on it. This is the first almost completed first production uh, line quality cove. Over time, they've made some changes like making sure the cove was long enough to tuck under the bed and patient. The drape is longest over the body, and this is what really allows optimal CPR. If you noticed, Ian was really able to slide his hands maybe up the patient's body. And really focusing on keeping those viral particles away from healthcare providers. The cove will be under negative pressure from wall suction. Uh, you will hook up this tube to wall suction, and it will pull across a viral filter, so no virus will escape the cove. With help from Harbor Designs, Dr. Trapello and his team are hoping to get the Care Cove out to health care providers by the end of the month. From Television Park, I'm Erin McPherson. Unbelievable. Thank goodness for smart people. Click with us online at WMAR2news.com for updates on top stories and breaking news. Also for news and weather while you're on the go, download the WMAR2 app in the App Store. You can watch all the live radar and breaking news sent right to your phone. Thanks for watching. I'm Jamie Costello. This WMAR2 News update is sponsored by Jones Junction.